Array is one of the larger maps, and instead of being a generic Call of Duty snow map, this offers a handful of routes that allow for some long range fragging as well as some up close gun battles. Array is hands down my favorite map in the original rotation. Just about any weapon is usable. Black Ops Spawn is home to a large open area with a couple of bunkers and trucks which can provide you great cover when getting good angles on your enemies who are camping in Array Tower. A major choke point on this map would be this truck ahead where the doorway is. A quick nade at the start of the round can get you multiple kills. You can use the back of this truck for cover because it won't blow up. If you find yourself on this hill, you'd probably want to move fast. Keep your eyes open for guys camping under this wedge. Once this truck is blown to smithereens, feel free to use it for an elevated position that allows you to see angles into both spawns. Moving towards Spetsnaz spawn, there is a large crane that offers a couple of levels that will give you huge peaks down the side of the map. But don't stay here too long because nobody likes campers and any smart player will figure you out. Climbing this satellite dish might not give you the best cover, but it gives you a good peek down the electrical tower. This unfinished building doesn't have great cover either. Thin walls will get you killed, but it does have this neat little peek if you're just passing through. The rock area is a strong choke point because it's surrounded by spawns. It can give you some good cover while looking down on your enemies. Be cautious of claymores around these stairs above the guardhouse. They're pretty narrow, so chances are you'll get a kill or be killed. Into this ice cannon, you can jump onto this ledge and be out of range from most grenades and bullets when proning. Below the electrical tower is a pretty wide open area and gets picked on by a lot of people shooting from center array. You can jump on the legs of the electrical tower to get some amazing cover while still having good peaks on your enemies one of my favorite spots to play. There is a huge open area that leads back to the original Black Ops spawn, but for now we'll skip that and head to Center Array. When running next to this pallet and forklift, you arrive at the guardhouse. Both are critical choke points for traffic. Climbing these boxes to the Center Array will allow you to avoid all the popular routes and chokes where you're most likely to be killed. Beware of claymores when passing through the rooms. If you jump out this window onto this railing, you can get a cool spot that peaks the propane tank and the main entrance of Array Tower. Heading into bottom Array, you'll see this back tunnel that isn't used enough. It will allow you to get behind enemy lines quickly, so use it. As always, we hope you found these tips useful. Just remember, Array is one of the most versatile maps offered, and no weapon is the wrong weapon.